Here we go then, Bike Shed Show London 2023, the Everest build. You've seen how it all came together on the YouTube channel already, so I'm gonna run through all of the cool kit that we've got on the bike. We've got, from the front, moving backwards, Dunlop Shod Rubber, obviously. The Dunlop are fantastic bikes. These are the, uh, I'm just gonna check, they're the Sport Smart TTs. We've got loads of different Dunlop Rubber on all the different bikes. Fantastic tires. I've had these on my PCO one. They grip in the dry, they're extremely tacky very, very quickly. We love them. Obviously, star of the show is going to be the carbon wheels. We've mentioned those loads before. They come from Rotorbox. They're an incredible bit of kit. They've got the carbon toe on there. They're just a really, really cool, unique, premium part to add to the bike. On top of that, we've got a PCC mudguard and a PCC headlight cowl with a PCC scoop. We've tried to put as many of our own touches on this bike as we can. We really feel now that we've got like our own, our own look, our own touch to a lot of the bikes. And this kind of sums up all of those in one package. Moving back from there, full blackout front end, motor gadget speedo with the CNC um, switch gears, which are very, very cool. We put them together with um, Thomas at Dev Moto, who's managed to work with the Canva system on the BMW bike. Behringer master cylinders on both sides, obviously, and the Coso headlight. The cockpit on this is as clean as you like. It is very, very minimal, gives you everything you need. Everything ties in together, even to the point where the full blackout front end with the red adjusters then ties into the red switches. Everything has been considered on this build. Moving backwards, again, we've got the star of the show, I guess, really well, it's difficult on this bike, there's lots of stars of the show. The Valkyrie paintwork, it's part of the Midnight series. So as you move around the bike, it looks almost dark or black in some places. And then as you move and the light hits, you can see all these cool geometric shapes. So the guy who owns this bike and put the, um, the brief towards us, is somebody who loves climbing. That's why it's called the Everest. He's somebody who's been up, he's been to Nepal and done climbing. He's, I think he's in Kilimanjaro at the moment. We want to have these angular, almost mountain-like shapes across the bike. It was kind of a very cool brief and something we've not done before. Valkyrie Paintworks have smashed that again. Wayne has then asked us to compliment that with a seat done by JK Upholstery. James is unreal. And what he's managed to do is match the, um, the geometric shapes in the tank all the way through the seat to the back hump where there's a really subtle 29 number. A bit of part of the touch that we have with the Midnight Series is that they're numbered. We chose 29 because 29,000 feet, Mount Everest. Really, really cool. We're like these little subtle touches. Uh, Wayne, the owner, has then complemented the build again with the unit garage cylinder head covers with the Pier City Airbox removal kit. And underneath is the G&G &G low box system. It's a full system. It's really cool. Again, really angular. It just works really nicely with the brief. Uh, AC Schnitzer brake reservoir cover, Gillies rear sets. Really, we've gone to town with this bike and we're extremely pleased with how it's come out. And the doors have only just opened at the show, but it's getting a lot of attention already.